What's going on ladies and gentlemen, this is Demostorm back with Crossout. So today I thought I would show you guys how to build a vehicle. Just from the ground up, you know, no starting pieces, nothing. How to build a vehicle. So a lot of people are wondering, how the hell do I just build my vehicle? A lot of people use that starter truck or whatever you have, you know, if you bought the premium pack to get into the beta. That's that's all you. So I'm just going to build a simple vehicle. We're going to put four, sh four long and just pick up our starter cabin for those who haven't actually got to play the game that much. So we're going to put her... I can get that center of mass about there. This allows for the wheel wells to, you know, be over the wheels. So we're just going to take our little indestructible ones. Just in case we lose, we don't lose durability on our main package. Because I'm not going to build, you know, this high-end vehicle to show you guys. Because a lot of people don't start that way. I don't understand what the whole showing, you know, later game over the beginning game. Because some people need to learn how to play the game right away. You know, you don't want to suck for too long. You don't want to do this, that, or the other thing. So let's just get our little wheels on. Put them dead center. And I'm probably going to move down these fenders if I can. Nope, we're going to leave them like that. Oh, well. Good is good. So let's see. What do we want as our back piece? So you want something with a little bit of armor. This says 11. Probably do better somewhere for a back piece. Even, you know, that's not actually that bad. That is a structure score, 280, so, you know, it's hard to break off and just add a little bit of extra armor. At the top of the screen, you can see the button presses to, you know, help you armor that up. There we go, make it nice and flat. And we can actually, can I, hmm, I can. That makes that a little bit more armored. So the 280 structure means that I'm going to have uh, a good back defense so people can't just shoot up my rear end and just destroy me. I'm going to add these plates on the back just so we have a little bit of extra armor. It's going to look a little wonky in the end, but, you know, you can also control click to add pieces if you want to like that. But I'm actually going to put these correctly... Because they open and close when you're driving. Oop. Control Z. All the little windows things still work. I'm going to do that. Just as a little bit of armor protection on our sides. Because we don't want to get trashed by machine guns. Machine guns will trash you. Don't pretend that, you know, a starting machine gun won't do damage. Everything does damage. So to give us a little bit of a flat bed. We're going to put this right on flat. There we go. Look for those weld connections. And because we have this little area right there, I'm actually going to put a weapon radiator. I know it's the starter vehicle and, you know, weapon radiator might not be the best choice. But we're going to put our flat in there. Look at that. We got a weapon radiator in there. So if you want to, you can either a, you know, give it a little bit of a slope. Just like that. Cover her on up. And... I don't know how I feel about that. We could probably armor that better. There we go. Make it look like we have a little thing in the back. But that'll protect us pretty well. Ow. That's actually what I want. So because it has, you know, quite a high structure point. This has 280 points. This has 45. You know, we have quite a lot of armor in the back. So we can protect anything we want to put in the back. Such as an oil drum or whatnot. We're going to put our little push bar in the front. And let's add some weapons. So we're just going to put the two starter machine guns on here. You know, just because starter vehicle. And let's see what else. So we want to armor up a little tad bit. Let's see. How do we want to armor her? So either A, we can do that or we can like put just tin pieces across some people will build these little wings out to protect your tires honestly i don't know i haven't seen i've seen it's the difference of weight reduction bro versus you know all the other fun pieces in the game <laughs> i don't i don't see a point in you know adding a shitload of weight um usually i'll put an oil drum in the back just you know to keep get oil for raids raids you can see this fuel gauge up here allows you to do these raids to get copper pieces which you know you need 10 fuel and that will give you the players to play with. Every 75 EXP gets you copper. Copper, in turn, gets, lets you craft. 
So for the manufacturing one here, so you want to make the 88, you got to get 50 copper. Have a cannon, have a carjack, and have a medium wheel. So I actually have built a couple 88s. I sold one, you know, got some gold. So I can go into this, you know, market over here and shop around. Say I wanted, a, you know, 100 scrap right now. I could buy it. You know, straight up. Let's just, you know, show it out. 168. Cool. We placed an order. Did the order go through? Yep, we got 100 scrap, just like that. And if I wanted to, I can go to, you know, manufacturing. Let's just buy... I know I'm probably wasting a lot of my time doing this, but copper. Copper right here. 617. Wow. That market's up. So you could just buy it straight out. You know, you want 50 copper. All my money right down the drain, just like that. We bought 50 copper. So now in our storage, we have 143 scap, 56 copper. We're close to manufacturing that cool 88. You know, you can make a machine gun if you wanted to. A mini, little machine gun. I need to get a wheel. So the best way to get wheels with our little car that's probably not going to do a lot. Let's test her out first to make sure that she can actually even drive. You know, we got our center of mass. It's about right in the center of our vehicle. Shoot at our cars. And... So to show you guys, like, the defense in the back. It's going to be really hard for them to shoot us in the back. Best way to get us is the front of the, you know... The front of our vehicle, the sides. We got some armor plating all around. They're probably going to blow into our fender and just shoot us like that, but shows that we have some good armor on board. So let's see. Did we use all our power points? We have one more. Hmm. We could take off a machine gun and put a shotgun. That'll fill our power up. Yeah, might as well do that. And before we do that, we're going to switch our button presses. So our shotgun's on the right click. The machine gun's on the left. That allows us to, you know... Hold our shots on our shotgun till farther range. Cool thing about shotguns is if you aim for certain pieces of a car, you can usually blow them right off. Let our shotgun rebuild. You know, we're just trashing our own vehicle right now. Allows for that armor. So yeah, we have a vehicle kind of built. Very basic. Has a 1,584 power score. Has some armor. And let's see. Do I have... No, we can't put that. We don't have another machine gun. That's our problem right now. So once again, change that. Make sure you do that every time if you, you know, want to be something on a different one. And let's get ourselves a wheel. Mm, yeah, let's get a wheel. So the way to get these parts is, you know, you got to get at least 125 EXP to get anything out of a match. I'm probably going to get trash, guys. Sorry, I'm not very good at commentating and playing this game. I don't know why. I don't know if I should do commentation on top of it or just kind of, you know, roll with it. But there is, you can have a lot of bad matches in this game. Don't get discouraged. You know, some people will rage quit right at the beginning. So I can feel the heavy ass end of our car. I like how she's coming, though. You know? From there, we can change things, you know, put armor plating like that guy, get an engine, move faster, all that fun stuff. Ugh. So we need that scrap. We also need a cell cannon. <laughs> Just rebuild our money again. Usually, I won't do anything crazy like that. You have to keep the premium money for other things. Uh, premium money is not only, you know, you don't only have to pay money for that. You can sell parts in your storage, and the market will buy them instantly with the tax rate and whatnot. Sorry, dude. Didn't see that you had a cannon. I thought you just stopped moving. So I can feel our ass end. Feel that. We probably should be a front-wheel drive car. That or put four wheels that can turn. Take the four-wheel drive and just kind of roll with it. We got some assistance right there. We're going to get wrecked by Ashley over there with a the machine gun shooting us down. Be careful. Snipers like to hide on that ridge in this level, so a lot of the times the other side will have snipers already hooked up before we even reach this point. I don't understand it. It seems like the faster cars are usually in here by now. You know, as you saw, they were capping right away. It's usually that side always wins to the cap. We do not have the armament to do shitloads of damage. 
You're getting flanked. We're just gonna shoot their little tower. Death. I should probably aim at the machine guns, you know. And there we go. We got blown up. Oh well. It happens. You're gonna get blown up. You're gonna get pushed down in this game, but don't worry about it. Don't ever get discouraged. This guy's got the turreted, you know, 76 on top. Hopefully we'll have some sort of assistance to our team. Nope. Bot aim right there. Oof. There we go. And we won. Look at that. Hopefully we did enough damage to actually get something out of this match. So we got a radio. We can head back to our garage. This isn't going to be mostly gameplay. It's going to be, you know, the building part of the gameplay. So we got our little radio. If you wanted to, you can send out the coordinates. That or you can sell it for some gold. Get that premium currency up. You know, instantly sells usually. And you get the premium currency. I call it premium currency. It's just coins. So you can sell stuff and whatnot. So, all that fun stuff. That and if, say, we need some scrap. I don't know. Say we don't want our 76 anymore, we can salvage it. Say we don't want a wheel, we can salvage it. All that fun stuff. But I'm going to work on the game a little bit more, guys. Get some more parts, show you guys some stuff off. Right now, I am part of the Nomads, which, you know, they have the fucking Vulcan right there. What is the power score? It's almost as high as my car alone. Get some purple items, blue items to craft. You can get this little... Thing right here it has 10 points so it allows you to have like two cannons if you really wanted it but well, we got to get this and a car jack better build some tracks you know right now and everything we can build two tracks probably if we wanted to anyways guys i've been demo hopefully you guys enjoyed and this is how to build a car in cross out bye everybody